On today's menu, a simple and delicious recipe that's rich, earthy, and a little nutty. A crunchy peanuts and chili noodles. Lei ho ma, that's how's it going in Cantonese. Welcome to Young Man Cooking, I'm Will Young. This is definitely the noodle lover's dream and it's really simple to put together. Before we get started, if you enjoyed today's recipe, definitely leave a comment below, give it a thumbs up. Let's begin. Bring a pot of water to boil for the noodles. Non-stick pan. Medium heat. About three tablespoons, peanuts. One tablespoon white sesame seeds. Toast for about a minute. Toasting will get them to release their natural oils and get this incredible smoky flavor. Pass the lemon water. Transfer in the toasted peanuts and sesame seeds. Crush coarsely. Carefully not to over crush so that they'll retain its delightful crunchy texture. Set aside the peanuts and sesame seeds. Three pieces of garlic, grated. Taking the time to grate the garlic will bring out its natural oils and incredible flavor. Two sticks green onions, chopped. We do get a lot of questions about the different tools and brands or knives and pans that we use on the show here on YouTube and we definitely try our best to answer all of those questions but of course it's always ongoing so there is a official Young Men Cooking newsletter that goes out every single week where I write a short snippet about the different brands and tools that we use here on the cooking show. If you have been following the channel for quite some time, you might have noticed that we don't normally do a lot of brand sponsorships. I want to encourage everyone to try different brands, different products, just because their products are brands that you've seen on the show here and works well for me, it does not necessarily mean that it will work well for everyone else. But if you are curious to know what brands and products we use on the show, definitely check out that newsletter. You can sign up for it at youngmancooking.com. And of course, it's super casual. You can unsubscribe at any time. So let's continue cooking. Boil the noodles for half a time to package instructions, in this case about 3 minutes. In this episode, I'm using 250 grams frozen udon noodles, but even spaghetti will work fantastic with this recipe. Seems like I can never keep these bottles full. This is a delicious, smoky, spicy chili oil made in the previous episode. Definitely leave a link in the description box below for you to make this really easily at home. Heat the pan to medium-low heat, then add in 1 tablespoon of chili oil. Garlic. Cook the garlic for about 45 seconds. Cooking the garlic on low heat will give it time to infuse even more flavor into that already flavorful chili oil. 1 teaspoon sweet paprika. 1 teaspoon toasted sesame oil. 1 tablespoon soy sauce. 1 teaspoon dark soy sauce. 1 teaspoon rice vinegar. 1 tablespoon maple syrup. I love maple syrup and I really enjoy that really nice cotton candy like sweetness and that rich almost caramel flavor but of course you can sub that out with any other sweetener that you personally prefer. 2 tablespoons peanut butter. In this episode I'm using a smooth and unsweetened peanut butter. You don't have to be strictly just using peanut butter or peanuts. You can definitely sub those things out for say cashew butter or almond butter. And instead of the toasted peanuts, you can use perhaps cashews. It'll still give it that nice crunchy texture and a delicious nutty flavor. The nut butter also acts as a bit of a thickener to that incredibly rich sauce. Couple of tablespoons, water. Give the sauce a good mix. This sweet and savory peanut sauce would also be fantastic with sautéed veggies served with freshly steamed white rice. Strain out the water from the noodles. Add the noodles to the peanut sauce. Green onions. 
turn the heat to medium, stir and cook for a couple of minutes. You'll start to see the sauce become rich and glossy and get absorbed into the udon noodles. Plate the noodles. Now you can add as much or as little of that crunchy topping as you like. Generously sprinkle over that amazing crunchy topping and serve. You can now go nuts over this delicious peanut and chili udon noodles. Man, that smells just incredible. Man, oh man, if you love peanut butter, this is just heavenly. Visually, it's beautifully rustic, super earthy. And from that first bite, you are just welcome with this huge depth of nutty flavor. The peanut butter is incredibly rich, and that sauce has this deep, earthy flavor with that soy sauce that adds some umami. That dark soy sauce gives the noodles this beautiful caramelized color. The maple syrup just heightens that sauce with this incredible cotton candy-like sweetness. And that chili oil, of course, just gives it that extra little bit of lift with that beautiful, smoky, aromatic flavor. You can definitely add some fresh red Thai chilies to increase the spicy level, or you can add a little bit more maple syrup to make it more on the sweeter side. The green onions just add that little bit of freshness and the toasted sesame seeds and peanuts just adds this extraordinary crispy crunch to these amazing udon noodles. It's rich, it's saucy, it's incredibly packed with flavor and so simple to put together. Definitely we'll make it to that weekly menu. This for me is one of those comfort dishes where you just can't be bothered. You have a little bit of peanut butter, a little chili oil, a little udon noodles, and you're good to go. If you love easy, delicious recipes like this, then definitely check out or pick up your copy of one of the three Young Man Cooking cookbooks. There is a print or digital version of these. You can also check out the Young Man Cooking merch, plant-based sushi masterclass, and of course, the ceramic official Young Man Cooking ramen bowls. I'll leave a link in the description box below for you to check out all those things. And of course, if you enjoyed today's episode, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below, and I'll see you in the next episode.